Hello guys, it's Johnny Time and welcome to another Decentralized Finance tutorial. Today we're gonna to learn everything that you need to know about Tranquil Finance, Tranquil Protocol on Harmony Blockchain. So if you are using Tranquil and you want to start using it and see how it works and what kind of interesting opportunities it has, make sure to watch this video till the end to get educated. Also, there are timestamps below, so if you want to jump to different sections, you can check it out. But it's better to watch it till the end to get the most value of it. So Tranquil Finance, the Tranquil.finance domain is money market and liquid staking protocol for Harmony One. So if you're not familiar with Harmony One, it's basically layer one chain, EVM compatible chain. The fees are super low and you can check it out here on DeFi Llama. I have also a tutorial about DeFi Llama, how to use it and how to get valuable information for it. So check out my tutorial about DeFi Llama. But if you look at the Harmony chain, we can see that Tranquil Finance is the second protocol in terms of TVL on only in the last month around 400% more value has been locked in this protocol. So this is a significant protocol that you definitely want to learn about. And what are money markets and liquid staking? We will understand in the moment. We'll go through the docs, we will go through the app, through every section and understand exactly what it is and how we can take advantage of it as DeFi masters. Now, let's go to the documentation and try to read a little bit. Tranquil Finance is an algorithmic money market and liquid staking protocol on the Harmony One blockchain. The money markets allows users to supply and borrow assets. So on one hand, you can supply assets. Here on the left, you can see the supply markets and using these assets, you're getting rewards and as a collateral, you can also take assets and borrow assets from the protocol. This is supply and borrow, money market, lending and borrowing assets. It's a fork of compound. Um, so the users can do it while receiving or paying interest in a completely permissionless and decentralized way. No permissions, completely decentralized. Borrowing and lending interest is set based on market demand. So let's say, for example, here, the more demand there is for Bitcoin to borrow, then you can see that you're going to pay higher interest. The more, uh, let's say, and you can see also that if you supply Bitcoin, you get higher interest rate. The APY will be much higher. And this model was pioneered by the Compound Protocol on Ethereum. So as I mentioned, it's a fork of Compound and also the money is over collateralized. If you go to Tranquil Finance Dashboard, you can see that there is total supplied assets if we open calculator uh, of um, around $240 million. And if you basically take this number, the borrowed assets divided by the supplied assets, you can see that the collateral is 47%, which is quite safe. There are more assets supplied than borrowed, unlike our banks. By the way, guys, if you find this video interesting and you want to get exposed to more videos and become DeFi master here with me and Johnny Time, make sure to subscribe and click the bell notification button. Also, check out my other videos. I have so many playlists divided by categories, by ecosystem, by protocols, and you can get exposed to so much free educational content and get involved in your DeFi journey here with me. Also, if you have any questions or we want to join the Johnny Time family on Discord, check the link in the description below. We have so many channels where people help each other. We have general chat, support, Farms and pools, stable coins, NFTs, suggestions. If you have any interesting protocol that you want me to make a video about and do some research, this is the community for you. Join in the links in the description below. And if you don't know, I'm doing anything here for free. Anything because my goal is to get people educated and spread the world and help people get into DeFi and crypto. And this is my value to the world. And if you want to support me and help me scale up this channel by hiring editors and people that will help me out to create basically more quality content, please consider joining my Patreon and donating a small amount of money every month because everyone can donate a small amount of money and using this money, I will able, be able to create more amazing content for you. And if I helped you, if you appreciate my work here, then uh, just, just consider doing it. And 10% of all the income I'm gonna donate because I always believe in donation and helping people and bringing value to this world so you can get assured that 10% of all the donations on your money that you're gonna put here, if it's a $10 tier, 20, 30, 100 or whatever you put, gonna be donated and 90% gonna be directly into the growth of this channel. Thank you so much and now let's get back to the video, honest. Okay, so, uh, <laughs> but high gas fees have made the protocol untenable for most users. 
As you know, the fees on Ethereum are super high because it's proof of work and it has scalability issues. And building on Harmony once gives the Tranquil protocol fast and cheap transactions, democratizing access to everyone. Another feature in Tranquil Finance is liquid staking. This is another feature that does not exist on on basically on compound on ethereum st1 which allows the user to stake one tokens for reward so if you are bullish on harmony and you have exposure in your portfolio to one token you can stake it on trackill and get rewards and get st1 token as a receipt token and meanwhile your one is getting yields and interest rate you are able to use it on harmony DeFi ecosystem because this st1 token you can use it as a collateral for example and in the lending um, and st1 they say basically that st1 becoming the currency of choice in harmony because naturally the one token is deflationary by nature because the validators are getting rewarded by new printed one tokens so you can hedge the inflation by staking the one token on tranquil finance and use the st1 token in the DeFi ecosystem of harmony which is super cool now we won't go through all the docs because i know your time is uh, valuable for you you can check out the link in the description i'll put link for the docs we want to get the most value for you in this video so we're gonna get jump straight into the dashboards so here in the dashboard you can see it's very similar to the ux of a uh, compound if you're familiar with compound you can see the total supplied and total borrowed assets and on the left you can see the supply markets on the right you can see the borrow markets you can see that you can supply one token for example and get around 15 percent annual percentage yield which is great you can see how much one has been supplied and also if you tick this kind of checkbox over here it basically tells the protocols that you want to use the one that you supplied as a collateral and borrow against it maybe bitcoin maybe ether maybe usdc okay if you go over the apy here you can see that actually your apy has been divided by seven percent of market and around eight percent of reward which means that basically seven percent are being paid from the borrowers the people who borrow the one token and pay interest on the other side and there is additional eight percent that you're gonna get rewarded basically just because you use the protocol this is going to be in a form of trunk token the native token of the protocol and they want to incentivize more people to lock tokens and to use the protocol that's why they mean those strength tokens which is of course in deflation inflationary by nature but it's a cool thing to know that part of your rewards is going to be from the market and part of it going to be rewarded by the trunk token now other cool opportunities that you have over here is basically you can uh, provide bitcoin and get 9.25 percent apy which is great so if you are bullish long term on bitcoin and you have exposure to bitcoin you can put it here get around 10 percent yield a year which is amazing and you can use this bitcoin to borrow assets on the other side then you can use them to provide liquidity in the ecosystem and do other leverage rewards this is what i'm actually doing and that's why i wanted to share it with you guys you can also provide usd which is a stable coins and get nine percent apy but remember it's not that you only get nine percent apy you can borrow against it this is the power of money markets and that's why i love them okay and this is super cool you can see that you can borrow one and this is an interesting thing you can borrow ether and get paid on the same time so you take ether protocol and you get paid and how it's this kind of things happens is basically they, because they reward you with a trunk token for the market you're gonna pay five percent but they're gonna pay you 5.4 percent apy in form of trunk token which is crazy you are basically getting paid and taking asset did you ever went to a bank and asked for money and they told you yeah of course take hundred thousand dollars and we're gonna pay you for taking this money it never happens on centralized finance but it happens on DeFi, and this is why i love DeFi. so this is great and this is amazing and let's see what i'm doing in a tranquil protocol so this is my tranquil dashboard you can see that i deposited around eleven thousand dollars this is my net apy this is basically it summarized your supply and borrow api and you can see that i borrow only three thousand five hundred dollars because i actually adjusted it recently i'm gonna borrow more and this is super interesting here the slider over here it's very very important this is your bow limit now it's on 41 percent you want to make sure that it never goes to 100 percent because what happens let's say now if you can see here that i supply bitcoin ether and usdc and i borrow one 
against it. What happens if the one price is going up? What happens is basically that this kind of percentage will go higher and higher. And if it goes above 100%, I will be liquidated. The protocol automatically will take my Bitcoin, my Ether and my USDC and I will lose 10% immediately. So you want to keep track and make sure that it's usually I feel safe when it's around 70% which means that if you supply, let's say, uh, $10,000, you can borrow $7,000 against it. It will let you borrow $8,000, but the safe thing for me, because one might be volatile, even though it's on the top 100 tokens, I don't want to be liquidated. So I borrow only 70% against my assets. Um, this is important to know because this is the risk involved while using money markets. You can get liquidated if the asset that you borrow is appreciating more than the assets that you supply and you want to manage this risk. You can see right here that I uh, supply Bitcoin, I supply Ether and I supply a uh, USDC and I borrow one against it. Why do it? Because I use this one to provide liquidity in DeFi Kingdom and I get extra rewards. So it's not only that I get this 8.4% APY on my assets, I this kind of $3,600 are working for me in another protocol. This is the great thing about money markets. That's why I want to share this knowledge with you guys so you can use it the same and leverage it. Also, the trunk section token, this is all the section related to the trunk token. Basically, um, you can stake your trunk token here and you get 57% APR. This is great and the rewards, the cool thing is that basically you're going to get 70 um, Percent, it's reading over here 70 percent of all the protocols fees so the lenders and the borrowers are paying also a small amount of fee to the protocol itself and the rewards of the protocol the, the collected fees from the protocol are going to be paid to the locked trunk staking so you can stake your trunk token if you're bullish trunkle you want to get exposure to trunkle you want to make sure that you lock it over here and get 57 percent in form of a uh, uh, all these kind of cool tokens, Bitcoin, Ether, USDC, USDT, One, ST1, and Trunkle. So you get a uh, fees in different tokens. This is super cool because this is the uh, basically the money that the protocol is making is giving it to the token holders. The catch is here is that you have to lock your trunk token for six months and if you withdraw it before the six months you will be suffered from 50 percent penalty so this is only if you are long-term bullish on the trunk hill and you want to get some extra yield i i suggest it's not a financial advice to check out this option you can see that right now the project earns a year around two million dollars in terms of fees and this fees of course gonna go to the trunk stakers and also if you want you can also add liquidity for trunk one on sushi swap and get 121 percent apr this is 10 percent a month not compounded yield which is quite cool if you are true bullish trunk bullish one this is another opportunity for you if you want flexible staking so this is flexible staking is very very similar to the lock staking that that just that your funds will not be locked for six months you can withdraw them anytime without paying any penalty uh, of 50 percent but of course the apr will be lower and we have the x trunk that i don't want to touch because it, the video is getting too long and i want to get into the important stuff now st1 is also another cool thing uh, we talked about it a bit in the documentation you can stake your one here this one is going to the validators of the harmony chain as you know harmony is proof of work chain and our people who stake the one token and get rewards and the one is being minted to them very very similar to bitcoin and ethereum miners but this time you stake your one and you get rewards so by staking one you can get this kind of st1 token you can you can see right now st1 worth 1.000881 so st1 worth more than one one and the st1 will be your receipt token so you can anytime unstake it and get more one tokens and the more time pass st1 will worth more one because all the rewards from the validators here are gonna be reflected here on the price of st1 and one so when you hold st1 if you stake one here you will get of course less st1 but your st1 will worth more one in the next years because it's getting interest and the apy right now is around 9.5 percent apy which is quite cool so if you're bullish one this is another opportunity for you you can stake it here and then you can use this st1 in other 
uh, you can actually take this ST1. What you can do is super cool. You can stake one, get a 9% over here, and then you can go to the market, supply your ST1, get additional 9.4%, and then you can borrow more one and loop it. So this is quite cool. You can do a lot of interesting things, and this is why I love DeFi, and I want to give you the most amount of value and get you educated here with me. So make sure to subscribe. And also you can provide liquidity for ST11, which is quite stable and get 41% APR. And the UI is super simple, so I won't guide you through every, any button of stake and stake. It's quite uh, makes sense and very easy to use. You can claim your rewards here, stake, unstake. In terms of the markets, you can borrow here. And this is the supply, so you can deposit and withdraw assets. You can use it as collateral. If you want to borrow assets only after you put some collateral, then you can click, for example, here on Ether, and then you can borrow. You can choose how much you want, but here you can see that in order to borrow, you need to deposit collateral first. So yeah, that's about it. This is Tranquil Protocol, super interesting protocol, the second on the Harmony chain. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please consider helping me by smashing that like button for the algorithm. So more people that want to learn about Tranquil Finance, they will find this video very easily. Thank you so much for watching my videos and we'll see you in the next tutorial. Bye bye.